ik zeg altijd zo mooi, we staan backstage op Lowlands, maar eigenlijk staan we gewoon frontstage, here, right for the audience. And I'm talking to C.W. Stone King, welcome. Uh, hello, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Um, you lived till your ninth um, birthday uh, by the orig Aboriginals. Has that any musical influence on him? I guess there's a little bit of it. Uh, there's some sort of tone there. I couldn't really describe it, but yeah, there probably is some. Because you play sort old-fashioned blues from before the Second World War, am I right? Well, I'm not actually playing anything from before then, but uh, I guess the, some of the sounds that is inspired me is is from that era. But you know, I write all my own tunes and. They have elements of new things in them as well, I suppose, but I guess to most people it sounds old, yeah. But you're a quite young guy. Why are you so inspired by that kind of music? Well, you know, Robert Johnson died when he was about 24 years old. Uh, that was young dudes uh, playing, you know. It's just a different style of music as old. It has no age barriers, you know. You no age barriers, you're right. Yeah. How does it feel to play at uh, such a hip, trendy festival as Lowland? I don't know, I don't think they're any trendier than in some other joint I've been, you know. That's cool, I don't hang around with no, too much old farts or anything, you know. But you, you hang around, uh, did you have see some bands here? What, what bands would you like to see here? I haven't even looked at the program. I, I saw some magazine, but it was all in Dutch. I couldn't understand exactly what was happening, but... Uh, you can read the names. I can't understand, I was just looking if there's any good looking girls on the bill, but... Uh, They must have left them all out of the program. I'll have to just uh, hang around backstage and see what uh, is going on. Are you often play at this kind of festivals? Yeah, we do, yes. This year, we, that's what we've been doing uh, for the last uh, f three months or so, just doing festivals each weekend uh, through the UK and over here in Europe as well. You've got already a fan base here in Holland because last year you played at a cartoon festival in, in Harlem, I read. Cartoon Festival, yeah, I think we did play in some cartoons. In Harlem. In Harlem, yeah, there you go. Yeah, we've done a few things. I guess we've been on the TV a couple of times, so uh, that always helps get a few people into the shows and things like that. And uh, Okay, what are the plans? Future plans, touring, maybe a, maybe a third record? Yeah, I'm working on a third record and... Uh, Try and get that happening, and then we're going to uh, do some more touring next year, you know. Um, Is it still in the same uh, traditional musical style, that third album? Well, it's going to be a little different than the first two. The second one was different than the first, and the third one will be different again. I'm using the electric guitar now, not now on stage, but, you know, with uh, all the stuff I'm working on is with the electric guitar, so there's a different sound, you know few different influences and things like that. Yeah. When can we expect that album? When? When? Uh, early next year sometime. Uh, recording and touring at the same time this year? Yeah, kind of. I wish you a lot of success. CW Stone King was that. <laughs>